Hello and welcome. This video has interesting facts about Robert Hansen. At the end, you'll learn about the International Spy Museum in Washington, D.C. that I visited and highly recommend. Robert Hansen was a Federal Bureau of Investigation agent who spied for Soviet and Russian intelligence services against the United States from 1979 to 2001. His espionage was described by the Department of Justice as possibly the worst intelligence disaster in U.S. history. On June 5, 2023, Hansen was found unresponsive in his jail cell and was pronounced dead after unsuccessful efforts to revive him. He was 79. In 1979, three years after joining the FBI, Hansen approached the Soviets to offer his services. Throughout his spying, he remained anonymous to the Russians. Hansen sold thousands of classified documents to the KGB that detailed U.S. strategies in the event of nuclear war, developments in military weapons, technologies, and aspects of the U.S. counterintelligence program. Hansen also revealed a multi-million dollar eavesdropping tunnel built by the FBI under the Soviet embassy. Hansen was arrested on February 18, 2001 at Foxtone Park near his home in Vienna, Virginia, after leaving a package of classified materials at a dead drop site. He was charged with selling U.S. intelligence documents to the Soviet Union and subsequently Russia for more than $1.4 million in cash and diamonds over 22 years. To avoid the death penalty, Hansen pleaded guilty to 14 counts of espionage and one of conspiracy to commit espionage. He was sentenced to 15 life terms without the possibility of parole. The FBI believes that the Russians never knew the name of their source. He refused to use the dead drop sites that his handler, Victor Cherkashin, suggested and instead chose his own. Cherkashkin joined the KGB in 1952 and retired in 1991. He was the case officer for both Aldrich Ames, a CI counterintelligence officer, and Hansen when they spied for the Soviet Union. In 2004, he presented the book Spy Handler at the Spy Museum in Washington, D.C. The International Spy Museum is an independent nonprofit history museum which documents the tradecraft history and contemporary role of espionage. It holds the largest collection of international espionage artifacts on public display. The museum houses more than 7,000 artifacts with around 1,000 on public display, accompanied by historical photographs, interactive displays, film and video. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. Also, leave your comments below. Thank you for watching.